some exciting new stuff is happening at Cadence um, in the PCB group. We introduced our latest QIR, which is quarterly incremental release in late August. And we introduced, this week we announced industry's first real-time InDesign DFM technology. It is the only company that provides comprehensive design for manufacturing checks integrated with the electrical design rules. So an engineer, when trying to lay out a board, is meeting the electrical requirement, electrical rules, is also checking his work against DFM rules. And it's first, it is comprehensive. We've got over 2,000 rules in there. It avoids a lot of problems that are found later on. It avoids those because these problems are identified as soon as they're made, and therefore they're easier to fix because the designer finds out as soon as he or she makes it. And it's easier to fix because there's not a whole lot of other things to move around. So it's easier to fix. It avoids iterations between the manufacturing sign-off and the designer. So that saves a lot of iteration, a lot of time. So that's one big thing. Another big thing we've done is introduced some security technology analysis capability inside of Allegro PCB Designer that lets the PCB Designer check for impedance mismatches, for example, and coupling checks that allows them to avoid crosstalk problems. These are called impedance um, analysis and vision and coupling analysis and vision and the reason why we call it that is because we use security technology to do the analysis but then show the results inside of Allegro PCB editor so the PCB designer has access to the results on the same canvas that they're doing the PCB design so the designer doesn't have to wait for the signal integrity engineer to check for problems and then communicate those problems through emails, PowerPoints, and so on. Uh, but they get the results directly on the canvas. Now they're able to not only look at the results on the canvas, but also filter it very quickly, very easily, and find the problem areas, fix the problems, and avoid that iteration with the signal integrity engine. So this is using proven security technology, and it's embedded inside of Allegro PCB design. So those are couple of key improvements. There are a lot more improvements in the quarterly incremental release. So anybody out there that's using Allegro should go get on to 17.2 release QIR4 in, in the August release uh, of the QIR. So IPC 2581 has a consortium and the consortium is made up of PCB design and supply chain companies. So companies like Cadence, uh, Mentor, Zucan, Altium all support 2581. Then there are companies like Harris, Fujitsu, Cisco, Qualcomm, Microsoft, and you name it, the OEM companies support it. Then there are a whole bunch of software companies that supply software to manufacturing companies that support it. So Frontline Software, for example, supports 2581. The consortium has 94 companies that support 2581 actively, and it's continuously growing. There are companies that have switched to 2581 as the only way to go to manufacturing. It's so simple, easy to understand, uh, open XML-based format with one single file you can communicate to your design intent. IPC 2581 is an intelligent format. ODB++ is also an intelligent format. The difference between the two at the very beginning is fundamental in that ODB++ is a proprietary format owned by Metro Graphics or a Siemens, now part of Siemens. And it's not an open standard. Even if you want to look at who's using it, you've got to sign a you know, two-page contract to say, I support you, just to even look at the format. So that's not an open standard. Um, that access to that ODB++ can be taken away anytime at mentor's discretion. IPC 2581, on the other hand, is an industry standard driven by industry, enhanced by industry, supported by industry. This consortium of 94 companies is just the tip of the iceberg. There are many more companies that support the open standard in 2581. 
So it's an industry standard. So it is, it is just being able to have an open standard with no strings attached, have access to it without any restrictions to it, no strings attached.